Dear neighbor, during the month of May, I'm going to be working on a project to photograph everyone in Oxford. I will be contacting you during these next couple of weeks to answer any questions you may have and to set up appointments. We would like you to dress as you are, not as you might look in your Sunday best. Thank you, and I hope to see you soon. Sincerely, Peter Feldstein. Well, 20 years later, I started thinking about doing it again, uh, but I didn't have an I, I didn't have a concept in mind that would be other than just doing it again. At that moment, the light bulb went off, and thus began the Oxford Project. Peter came back the next day, or two days, sitting on our porch in Iowa City, pretty summer afternoon, and Peter showed me diptychs, or two panels, photographs taken in 84 and photographs taken in 2005 of the same people. And you could just, uh, my jaw dropped, you could just scrape it up off of the, uh, uh, the floor of our porch. And, and finally I said, you know what, I'll do a book if you'll interview the people that I'm photographing. And he said, what can I add to this? This is perfect the way it is. And I said, no, they've got stories. Everybody's got a story. Or as my mother would say, everybody's got their own tsuras, which is Yiddish for trouble. I had a congregation of perverts. I think I'd be dead. I think I would have drugged myself to death. There was a, an immense deep sadness in many lives. Um, Peter's wonderful, sublime pictures showed that, but the words that I got from people vindicated that. 1996, it was Christmas, and my kids wanted to buy me an outfit for Christmas. They couldn't find one big enough, and I weighed well over 400 pounds. I just want my, um, my kids to grow up and think of others before themselves. They're also, though, in equal numbers were people who, who showed a jubilation in life. Oxford is the epitome of a large family. This really isn't the story of Oxford, it's really the story of us. This is a story of dreams, aspirations, of, um, of what could have been and what is.